fed up lecturers and admin staff paraded their grievances through the corridors of the Mtata campus, making sure all the lecture halls are empty. They want Walter Sisulu University closed down until their demands are met. The unions have been at the negotiation table for the last four months, but they have reached a deadlock. Now they are taking their demands for an 8% increase and permanent contracts for all to see on the streets. We are stuck because the salary range as of now is standing at between 8% and 10%. They are offering 4,25%. Remember in 2011 we received 5%, which was below inflation in 2011. 2012, we received nothing. We plead with whoever, any person who's got powers who can assist us, because we've been suffering, as you have had, since 2005. In the front lines of the protest is 64-year-old Nomyaniso Mpina. She has been a lab assistant at this campus for 33 years. She supports two adult children, her parents and three grandchildren. Mpina says she gave her life to this job, yet she can't afford to send her own children to this university. I can't send to my children to school because I have no subsidy. I have nothing. Walter Sisulu University says it can only afford to pay its staff 4.25%. It says the sustainability of the university will be put in jeopardy if it grants an increase that is not affordable. Sandy McCowan, Ntata, Eastern Cape. News that moves. ENCA.com.